According to the passage, the old man was standing on the veranda because. Now, I've covered up the choices so that we're not going to let ourselves be tempted. I want to just teach you the strategy of just keyword searching. We, you know, veranda is kind of a, a strange noun. It's, it's, not, it's not a noun that's going to be overused in this passage. And I think that if we just sort of dive back into the passage and use our brains like sponges and just skim the passage for the first incidence of the word veranda... I think we'll find the answer. So we're trying to determine something explicit about what's happening in the plot from from the passage. So why was the old man standing on the veranda? Let's just look for veranda and see what it says. So rather than reading this, what I am doing is just sort of allowing my eyes to fall over the passage and just looking for, honestly, I'm looking for the letter V. I'm looking for the word veranda. Uh, And here I found it on line 16. I'd underlined it. When they reached the house, they found that the old man was waiting on the veranda with the lantern in his hand. That doesn't tell me why. Let's keep reading. Moths were shuddering round and round the lantern, though the old man was oblivious to them. Nothing yet. He had come out because, (laughs) there we go, he had come out because he heard the throbbing of the engine in the distance. Okay, so let's move over to the question again. Let's expose the choices, and let's see if anything matches. He came out to the veranda because he had heard the sound of the car. Choice A, he was watching cars travel down the road. Mm, That doesn't sound right. Uh, Two, the two boys had reported the visitors would soon arrive. That's not, that's not why. C, he had heard what he believed to be the visitor's car. I mean, that's, that's literally what it says. So I'm going to cross off A. Uh, D, he enjoyed listening to the quiet sounds of the evening. Yeah, that's not why. The, the text explicitly says the old man comes out to the veranda because he had heard what he believed to be the visitor's car. Right? Let, let's go back and look what it says, right? He had come out because, right, and here I am on line, what is this? 16, 17, 18. He had come out because he had heard the throbbing of the engine in the distance. And the choice that I selected was he had heard what he believed to be the visitor's car. So when you're asked to determine explicit meaning in this way, and, it, and it's around like a, a proper noun, like a name of a character or a location, or in this case, uh, a kind of out of the ordinary noun, you can just let your brain be a sponge and, <laughs> and kind of roll your awareness over the text until you find the keyword. Hunt for the keyword, read around that part of the passage, and you are likely to find the explicit correct answer.